How can you know if a solution is acidic, basic, or neutral? For that, we have two ways. The first way is by using a so-called iron product constant. Iron product constant is always 1 times 10 power negative 14 at 25 degrees Celsius. And this iron product constant is also equal to the H plus iron multiplied by the OH minus iron. Now when the H plus iron is greater than the OH minus iron, then this means this is an acidic solution. But when the H plus iron is less than the OH minus iron, then this means that this is a basic solution and when they are equal it means that this is a neutral solution let's say you are given here 1 times 10 power negative 3 of OH ions and you are told to find whether this is neutral or a base or an acid first thing we know that the KW is equal to the H plus multiplied by the OH minus ions KW is always 1 times 10 power negative 14. Let us just substitute the values. Here we will have 1 times 10 power negative 14 is equal to H plus multiplied by OH minus which is given as 1 times 10 power negative 3. Now to get the H plus we will divide both sides by 1 times 10 power negative 3. This here will cancel out. And this in the other side will give us the H plus ion as 1 times 10 power negative 11. Now we can see that we got the H plus here and it is less than the OH. So this means that this here is a basic solution. Or we can say that this is a base. Another way to know whether a solution is an acid or a base is to check the pH scale. When the pH scale is at 7, then it is neutral. When the pH scale is less than 7, then it's an acid. And when it is greater than 7, then it's a base. But how can you get the pH? Well, the pH is equal to the negative log of the H plus ion. And the POH is equal to the negative log of the OH minus ion. You also have to know that the pH added by the POH is equal to 14. What if you want to get the value of the H plus ion? Then you'll take 10 power negative pH. This will give you the H plus ion. And what if you want to get the OH minus ion? Then you'll take 10 power negative POH. This will give you the OH minus ion. Now let's try this question out. Calculate the pH and pOH for each of the following solutions at 25 degrees Celsius. Let us start with this one here, the first one. So we can see that we have 1 times 10 power negative 3 of OH minus. Now to get the pOH, we will take negative log of OH minus. So we'll take negative log of OH minus, which is given as 1 times 10 power negative 3. Do this in your calculator, you will get 3. So this here is the pOH. How about the pH? Now we know that the pH plus the pOH is equal to 14. To get the pH, we'll just substitute the value. So the pH plus pOH, which is 3, will be equal to 14. Take this, subtract both sides by 3, and you'll get your pH here as 11. Let's do the second question. Try this out. Given here H ion as 1, how can you find the pH and pOH? We'll just do the same things. So the pH will be equal to negative log of H plus. Substitute the value we'll have here negative log of H plus, which is given as 1. Calculate this, you'll get your pH as 0. Let's find the pOH. Now the pH plus the pOH, as we saw here is equal to 14 and we have the pH as 0 so we'll add 0 plus the pOH which we are looking for is equal to 14 so this means that the pOH will be equal to 14